क्वेश्चन इज गिवन ए स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री वेयर कंडीशन इज गिवन ए इज नॉट इक्वल टू बी वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए बी वेयर ए इज नॉट इक्वल टू बी एंड सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इज वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एडिशन ऑफ ए प्लस बी सो वॉट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ ए प्लस बी लेट्स ए सोल्यूशन हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए एंड बी राइट सोल्यूशन सो क्वेश्चन इज ए स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री दिस इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन नेक्स्ट इक्वेशन इज बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री दिस इज इक्वेशन नंबर टू नाउ वी कैन सब्ट्रैक्ट हेयर इक्वेशन वन एंड टू सो वेन वी आर सब्ट्रैक्टिंग सब्ट्रैक्ट इक्वेशन टू फ्रॉम वन देन वी विल गेट ए स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री एंड वी हैव टू सब्ट्रैक्ट दिस इक्वेशन राइट सो वी विल गेट हेयर ए स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू प्लस सेवेंटी थ्री माइनस सेवेंटी थ्री हेयर बी माइनस ए so b minus a right so here we got a square minus b square is equal to b minus a this is a square minus b square so we can use here formula a square minus b square is equal to value of a square minus b square is equal to a plus b a minus b so we can write a plus b times a minus b is equal to b minus a right now a minus b times a plus b is equal to we can if we are taking here minus uh, minus uh, sign common minus sign common here then we will get here a minus b right minus a and minus minus plus so plus b we are taking minus uh, sign common uh, in outside so we will get here a minus b times a plus b now uh, this is in rhs so if you are taking this term in lhs then it will become plus so plus a minus b is equal to 0 in equation form now a minus b a plus b a minus b so we can take a minus b common we are taking here a minus b common so left term that is a plus b plus 1 a plus b plus 1 is equal to Zero. Now we got here two equation. First one is a minus b equal to zero, and next one is a plus b plus one is equal to zero. So first one is a plus b equal to zero, or next one is a plus b plus one is equal to zero. So a plus b equal to zero. So we. So here first one is a minus b. This is minus. A minus b equal to zero, right? So a minus b equal to zero. Then we can say here a is equal to b. But in equation, this is already given condition. A is not equal to b. So this is rejected because a is not equal to b. This is given in condition. Now left uh, second uh, equation that is a plus b plus one is equal to zero. We have to this equation, right? So a plus b plus one is equal to zero. This is equation number three. Now here a plus b plus one equal to zero. So we can say here therefore a plus b is equal to minus one. Now we can say this is equation number three, right? Now. we have to add equation 1 and 2 given in question so equation 1 that is a square is equal to b plus 73 and b square is equal to a plus 73 we have to add here add equation 1 and 2 right so if we are adding this equation we will get here A square plus b square, a square plus b square is equal to b plus a, b plus a plus three three six and seven seven fourteen, so one forty six. We got here equation that is a square plus b square is equal to 
a plus b plus 146 but from equation 3 this is a plus b is equal to minus 1 from equation 3 right so a plus b this is a plus b a plus b is equal to minus 1 you can say this is equation 4 so substitute value of a plus b equal to minus 1 in equation 4 then we will get a square plus b square is equal to a plus b is minus 1 minus 1 plus 146 so it will become a square plus b square is equal to 145 right this is become 145 this is equation number 4 now from equation 3 a plus b is equal to minus 1 a plus b is equal to minus 1 right from equation 3 a plus b equal to minus 1 if you're taking here square so taking square both sides on both sides then we will get a plus b whole square is equal to minus 1 whole square now a plus b whole square value of a plus b whole square is this is formula so this is a square plus b square plus 2ab is equal to minus 1 square that is 1 right now a square plus b square a square plus b square is equal to 145 a square plus b square is equal to 145 from equation 4 so we have to substitute this value here so we will get here 145 plus 2ab is equal to 1 you can say this is from equation 4 so 145 plus 2ab is equal to 1 we can write this 2ab is equal to 1 minus 145 therefore 2ab equal to 1 minus 145 is 144 so minus 144 this is the value of 2ab now therefore we can say ab is equal to minus 144 divided by 2 2 7 ja 14 2 2 ja 4 minus 72 so value of ab is equal to minus 72 therefore we can say value of b equal to therefore we can say value of b equal to minus 72 by a right we can say this value of b value of b equal to minus 72 by a we need these two value in uh, future now from equation from equation 3 a plus b is equal to minus 1 right and value of b is equal to minus 72 by a so we can substitute this value here so you can say this is equation number 5 so substitute value of equation 5 in 3 then we will get a plus value of b is minus 72 by a is equal to minus 1 right now a minus 72 by a is equal to minus 1 now we, if you are taking here LCM then we will get here a so it will become a square minus 72 is equal to minus 1 so we can write this a square if you are doing cross multiplication here a square minus 72 is equal to uh, minus a right so a square uh, this uh, we will taking this one in LHS so a square plus a minus 72 is equal to 0 this is one equation form now 72 factor of 72 is 9 it's a 9 it's a 72 and 9 a plus uh, 9 a 9 it's a 72 and plus 9 a minus 8 a is equal to a so we are using this two factor here a square plus 9 a minus 8 a 
minus 72 is equal to 0. We are taking 9 common here. So, uh, sorry, A. We are taking A common here. So, left term that is A plus 9. And here also A plus 9. Left term that is minus 8A. Minus 8. So, minus 8A minus plus minus 8, 9, just 72 equal to 0. So, it will become A plus 9. First term A plus 9. And next one is A minus 8. A minus 8 equal to 0. We got here two equations. First one is A plus 9 equal to 0. A plus 9 equal to 0. Uh, or next one is A minus 8 equal to 0. Therefore, value of A is equal to minus 9 here. Or value of A equal to 8 here. So, we got these two value of A here. First one is minus 9 and second one is 8. Now, we have to find out the value of B here. Now, from equation B equal to minus 72 by A, right? So, if we are taking A1 equal to minus 9, so value of B1, B1 is equal to minus 72 by A1 is equal to minus 72 by A1. A1 is minus 9. This is A1 and this is A2. So, A1 is minus 9. Minus is cancelled from minus 9. It is a 72. So, we can say value of B1 is equal to 8. Now, B2. B2 is equal to minus 72 by A2. Is equal to minus 72 by A2. A2 is 8. Right. So, 8, 9 is a 72. This is minus 9. So, we can say value of B2 is equal to minus 9. Therefore, we can say value of AB equal to, if A1 is equal to minus 9, equal to, A1 is equal to minus 9, at that time uh, value of B is equal to 8. And if value of A2 equal to 8, so it will become B, uh, B2 is minus 9. So, this is the value of A and B here in this equation. Now, we have to find out the value of A plus B. So, A plus B is equal to minus 9 plus 8 is equal to minus 1. This is the value of A plus B in this equation. So, this is the solution. Thank you.